What's going on, everybody? I'll best keep 44 here from Game of Fusion. And for me, the most exciting thing from the Fallout presentation at Bethesda's E3 press conference was the Power Armor Edition. It's the Collector's Edition for Fallout 76. So just look at this thing. It's a glow-in-the-dark map, which is so cool. They showed it at the press conference. It glows up very nicely. A full-scale wearable T-51 Power Armor helmet with West Tech Canvas's carrying bag. This wearable helmet faithfully replicates the in-game model and comes complete with voice modulator speaker, functioning LED headlamp, and custom VATS sound feature. On the map is a 21 by 21 glow-in-the-dark vintage map showcasing the six distinct regions of West Virginia, which is really cool. 24 collectible Fallout figurines crafted from in-game 3D models. models. These detailed miniatures bring Fallout 76 vault dwellers, power armor soldiers, creatures, and more to life. Uh, you get the steelbook cates, and then you get some bonus in-game items as well, and access to the Fallout 76 beta. Uh, so all that stuff you get for this collector's edition. From what I'm seeing, it's going to be $200, which makes sense. I think it's actually worth it for this one. If you're a Fallout fan, you, you need this. You know, I, I'm picking this up for damn sure. I got my Vault Boy, not the Vault Boy, the uh, Pit Boy collector's edition for Fallout 4. I loved it, and I'm getting this one as well as soon as this thing comes available for pre-order. Of course, this is coming out for PS4, Xbox One, and PC, and it comes out November 14th of this year. Uh, really cool, a lot of hype for this one. Uh, leave a comment below. Let me know if you guys are picking this one up. Hit me up on Twitter at LBetsky44. Like the video, subscribe, and talk to you all later. Peace out, guys.